Uh, hello guys. Today uh, I'll go show you how to farm EC XP in uh, Lost Father. So this is the first day in the game. Uh, at the, this uh, bones, uh, when you run up, just before you take the the item over in this area over here. Uh, what you want to do is stay in this area, wait for it to fill up all the way. What you're going to do is stay uh, stay close to this area here. And what you want to do is when when Reaper spawns, you want to run up all the way here, run, run up all the way here, fast, like real fast, and like run up all the way up here. And if you if you're done quickly. Reaper will get stuck underneath in this area over here. Underneath here. And if he's stuck over here, you can actually start farming the enemies that spawns around here like this. Over and over in three times XP. This this is the fastest way in the game. Uh if if there was another way to find a way to like kill the Reaper or I, I do actually have another spot uh, where you can actually find the reaper but uh, it's not as efficient or as good as this area in the game I've been doing this now for 3 days uh, I had like over 6 million or 8 million or something like that uh, souls and yes I wasted a lot of fucking time doing this but you know uh, I like busy time. If you have seen my fan fantasy video, you know, you know this for me ain't nothing for me. Uh, but what you want to do is just stay down here, and let's say the reaper doesn't get stuck. All you need to do is run up here, and if you hear the reaper sound, you know this the sound when he goes under the ground and trying to follow you. And if he stuck down there, you know you're done right. All, all, what I don't recommend you do is get close to this area or too far over in this area. Like, this is the farthest you should go. Otherwise, the Reaper will come up and kill you. So, I'm gonna show you how it works once I get the item maxed out. Uh, also, I recommend. Uh, you're going to get him like 20k and level yourself up so that you get some stats uh, so that you can do a bit more damage to the enemy so you can do farming even faster uh, also if you had uh, like a Wii magic this farm will also be pretty easy uh, you can buy some magic from uh, Ombro magic from the, the invincible invincible guy in uh, the uh, what you call the the silver the arc race or whatever it's called, uh, and uh, you can buy that uh, magic which explodes and hit multiple targets. I'm not sure if you can buy it once you get the first time through, uh, but otherwise you could probably, probably buy something else that will help you. But there is not a lot of a attacks in this game. Uh, and the Umbro, the spear, whatever it's called, is probably one of the best moves in the game that you can get. Uh, also, the hammer slam is also one of the best moves in the game. Not only has it the best AoE in the game, it has the highest that one of the highest fire damage in the game, uh, which I use for all, all the whole game when I had it on my other character on PS5. Well, let's see if we can get diff. Let's see if we can get diff stuck here. Just a little more. As you can see, under the XP up uh, under my name, right now it's a two time XP. 
under the eye, uh, above the eye. There's a two timer. It means we get two times six P. And now as you can see, death real appear at the animal when the eye blinks red. Nah. What do I do? Run. And he did not get stuck. So just run again. Down here. So the eyes are blinking. Then we go up here. And, the, and then we just do it again. And he did not get stuck. So we here. His attack a bit trashy. But Dredge went back and forth. You're gonna need to do this a few times and it will work at some point. That's because he spawns right on you, that's why I recommend standing down there. Uh, like this. Come on. I'm too fast, I'm too fast. Come on. Don't do that. Don't do that. Okay, I think I got it now. Yeah, well, if you hear it like this, this is how it should be. He's now stuck. And as you can see, you can now stop farming. Or, he teleports in your ass. Which don't usually happen, I don't know, just because the game is way better on PC and that's why that happened. Could be the performance issue that we have on PS5 that the game is easier to do, but I'm pretty sure it should work. I did just not come here. If that's not too FPS. And now we should, it should work now. Don't still stay, stay away from that area. Yes, you just go up here and. Fine. I recommend going down here, but only if you stay away from him. Because he's, he has weird range of his attacks. So what you can do is stay up here, and as you can see, we get like 500 or 400 from one, from one monster here. Yep, 300 from one enemy. And if you don't want to get close, I, I on PS5 I can actually go all the way. I don't know what's the what's the difference this here on the PC version. I used to do this yesterday and he did not attack. It might be the update. I'm not sure though. But I can take the souls. And you can go just go back and forth like this. Farming. And later in the game, once you meet this a new sort of enemy that slides, he will start spawn, uh, spawning this area too. As a uh, monster you can kill. And he will drop you 3k, 3k XP, easy. Um, and that will be probably be way better than doing it early. But you can do this early, early game. And, and if you want to get overpowered, 
You could do this early, ask see for enemies. And don't be hit like me, but that really matter. Uh, as you can see, as you can see, E C X P. E C X P uh the cursor draw actually items here. But I work when doing like 100k here from the start. Then what where you go play to the arc peak? I think it's no, uh, you peak something that area in the game, and you're gonna fight some flying. So once you fight them, you should go after you defeat one. You should go back here, and they, they, these these enemies will start spawning here. They will not they will drop duralium, so you can upgrade weapons. They will drop uh, souls. Uh, they will stitches like these ones here and as you can see you will get freaking OP in this game early and that, 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 that that's actually pretty early too that you can farm uh, I keep missing that attack right there. and I recommend you going around farming here all day long if you want to. Uh, I also recommend uh, just get it to 100, then go to peak. Uh, I forget what I actually call like the peak something where you go on the side of the walls. Uh, once you go over to skeleton, that area you fight a flying beast monster thing. Uh, once you kill that, they will start spawning here as an enemy and I recommend you go back here and have a strong weapon that can two-shot it. I have a weapon. Uh, that way... Uh, you'll get like 2500 for one and they might drop uh, duralium to upgrade weapons. Uh, and you can buy the lucky paw from uh, the a guy with the cloak of his head, uh, a black cloak. He uh, says lucky paws that you can increase a uh, drop rate. So if you go here, you can farm this. Uh, this. Uh, Flying things and they will drop duralium for you. But I hope you guys like this video and like this farming method. And thanks for watching. Stay cool. See you around.